The fire broke out around 6 on Canal Street. And Channel 2's Taisha Walker is live on the scene for us this morning. Good morning, Taisha. What have you learned? Sophia, good morning. Arson investigators are now here at the scene. Take a look for yourself to see the damage left behind. You can't tell much right now, but if we show you video, you can see uh, some of the damage left behind. While we don't officially know what caused this fire, just minutes ago, the uh, fire chief here told me that there was uh, a skillet running when the employees came in this morning to try to set up for business today. Apparently, some grease inside of the skillet got caught into the vent hood where there was grease there too and that created a fire in the vent hood which then spread through the vent hood into the attic. We are told that all of the employees here at Tortilleria Reus was able to get out safely um, but one firefighter was injured trying to help extinguish that fire. We are told that he is expected to be okay. He suffered a minor leg injury um, but take a listen to the district chief talking about them trying to attack this fire where they think it's started. They were firing up the stoves, firing up the ovens, the grease pits, whatever they do, you know, to operate during the day. It seemed like that what might have started it. We have arson coming on the way right now, and I hadn't really got a chance to talk to anybody. Once I talk to the workers and we meet arson, then we should be able to find a, a, a cause of the fire. And back here live, you can see arson investigators are underneath that awning there. They are looking a little bit closer at that vent hood to try to piece this all together. But we 